In this lesson, I'll teach you how to time the stock market using a very simple system. Yes, you can time the stock market despite what you've heard. We'll be using a monthly chart with a simple 20-month moving average. Most free charting services like StockCharts.com and BigCharts.com offer this. Here is a monthly chart from StockCharts.com. Each one of these bars represents a month's worth of price action. This dotted green line here is a 20-month moving average. A simple 20-month moving average takes the last 20 months worth of closes, adds them together, then divides by 20. This number is plotted along a line. If the market closes above the 20-day line, it's in a bull market. If it closes below the line, it's in a bear market. It's that simple. Going back 10 years on this monthly chart of the S&P 500, you can see that we consistently closed above the 20-day moving average here from 1998 till about mid-2000 and that was a bull market. And then from mid-2000 on down to mid-2003 we were in a bear market as prices stayed under the 20-month moving average. And then in mid-2003 we got a close above the 20-day line and started a new bull market that lasted all the way till the beginning of 2008. And in 2008 you can see that we've entered a bear market, a rather severe one. Uh, as prices are nowhere near the 20-month moving average. In fact, it would take a rally back up to about the 1375 level to get us back into a bull market. You can use this 20-month timing model on any index or stock or ETF. Uh, here is the CRB index, which is the commodities index, and you can see that we were in a bull market uh, here from mid-2002 uh, till about mid-2006, entered a, a small short bear market here uh, from uh, mid-06 to mid-07, and then a raging bull market here um, in, in mid-2007 till mid-2008. And now we've fallen off a cliff, basically, and we have entered a bear market here um, in the latter half of 2008. And looking at gold, we entered a bull market here about mid-2001, and it's been uphill ever since, uh, from about the uh, 260, 270 level here all the way up to $1,000, over $1,000 an ounce here briefly. Uh, we have consistently closed above the 20-month moving average for many years now. Uh, the question is, can gold hold the 20-month line here and remain in a bull market? That's yet to be seen. And finally, looking at Apple Computer here, we can see that we were in a bull market uh, from early 2003 all the way up to mid-2008, and we have now fallen into bear market territory again here in the latter part of 2008. So as you can see, you can use this timing model for virtually any stock, index, or ETF. Learn to use this simple tool and you won't have to listen to brokers, advisors, talking heads on TV, stock tips, friends, relatives, gurus, etc. You'll be able to know instantly if your stock, ETF, or index is in a bull or bear market and will be able to trade accordingly.